Hi guys and welcome. My name's Marty. Today I thought I'd take you through a combination, a hit and abs circuit. So high intensity interval training with the abs in between each set. So each exercise will approximately go for about one minute. You don't need any equipment except for your mat. Maybe you'll need a towel to wipe off the drips of sweat and a water bottle. So go and grab those and let's warm up by starting with some inch worm moves. So start at the end of the mat, grow nice and tall, drop your chin to your chest, roll yourself down, scooping your belly, Warming up that spine by articulating through one by one, lowering down, and then walk your hands out into your plank. Hold it there for a moment, grow long through the spine, reach the heels, pull the belly, tuck the tail under, take a deep breath in, soften the knees, walk the hands back in for me. Beautiful. And tuck the tail under, lift that navel off the front of the pants, roll the shoulders down, restack that spine, grow nice and tall. Drop the chin to the chest. Roll yourself down, exhale as you do so. And let's walk those hands out. Find that plank, pull that tummy in, shoulders are down. Lots of length happening here. Tuck the towel under, bend those knees and start to inch yourself back up. Slowly roll through that spine. Here we go. Breath in, exhale, roll down. Inch yourself out, moving a little quick this time, holding it there. Reach through those heels, bend those knees, walk it back in and roll through that spine. Amazing work. Okay, so what I'd like you to do is find the center of your mat. Here's our first interval. I'll take a little lower. What I want you to do is start just tapping side to side, reaching side to side. Good, let's add those arms, reach out. Nice work, so belly is still tucked in, back is nice and flat. Now if you wanna take it up a notch here, you're doing your traditional star jump, pressing out, jumping in. You could also take it up a notch, TikTok arms if you wish. You could keep the arms high, taking it out. Beautiful, keep working here. So here's your low impact version if you prefer this class to be a low interval style of class with your abs in between. Otherwise, press it out. Don't stop, we're almost up to our minute. Keep it going, press out, press out. Four, three, two, and one. See, it wasn't too bad, was it? Let's head down to the mat. We're into our first exercise, chest lift. I want you to come on up, hands behind the head. Pull the knee in, press away. Pull the knee in, press away. Good, so we've got quick transitions here, so we're not wasting any time. We've got two rounds of everything, so we're gonna hop up and do our star jumps or our side taps again, and then we'll switch and pull the left knee in. I've got the right one at the moment, obviously. Pulling in, pressing away, finding that C curve, exhale, press in, press. Beautiful. Watching the clock there. We've got about another 15 seconds to go. Nice work. You can do this. Here it is, four, three, two, one. Hands behind knees, roll yourself up. Here we go, back to side taps or star jumps. Soft landing through those feet, press it out. Keeping strong, belly lifted. Beautiful. You could move faster if you wanted to. So many options available. Remember, this is your option if you're keeping it low. If you've got any injuries through those knees or ankles or feet, this will probably be much better for you. Out and in, we're halfway. Looking good, keep strong. Don't forget, anytime in between our transitions from one move to another, grab a drink of water. 15 seconds to go. Hopefully it's starting to feel warmer. Anytime halfway through the series, you'd like to drop out, well, not drop out, but modify to the low impact version. Every single exercise, I'm gonna give you that option. Here we go. We're down on the mat. Left leg into your chest lift. So remember your chest lift means 
peeling the shoulders, the upper back off the floor. Folding at the waist, pulling in, press away, in, press away, keeping those elbows back. If you prefer to make a hammock style hand set up for your head, as long as you're not jamming your head forward. Keep pressing. So this is our last exercise in our first round, and then we're switching it next time. Okay, how are we feeling? Keep moving. Can you lift a little higher into that chest lift for me? We've got 10 seconds here. Press, push, press, push. Five and four and three and two and one. Roll yourself up. Okay, right leg steps back into your lunge. Reach back, legs are parallel, step together. Reach back, step together. Low impact version there, you could add a hop and a jump, okay? Reach it up, down low. Reach it up, down low. I wanna see those levels. I want you high, I want you low. Don't lose your technique though. So if you're gonna do the jumping, avoid letting everything roll in or roll outwards. Okay, I'm gonna stay low. Press it down, lift that knee. You could still add the arms if you're doing low, impact, no jumping, and that's gonna help get your heart rate up. Now you're pressing through the heel of the foot that's on the mat. That's it. Keep lifted through that front of the body. Keep the shoulders relaxed if you can. Keep breathing, four, and three, and two, and one. Down onto the mat for me. Here we go, we're going into our scissors. Legs tabletop to begin with, reach them up. Hands behind head, keep lifting in your chest lift. First round, we'll keep the hands behind the head. Second round is where we'll add the arms. Keep reaching, beautiful. Keep it strong. You could modify if you need to, making a little arc, 90 degrees through the back of the knees. Otherwise, nice big scissors. How are we going? 15 seconds. You can do this. Can you get a little higher for me? Nice work. Awesome, guys. Doing so well. Avoid holding your breath. We've got four. We've got three. We've got two. Lunges coming up. Make sure you swap your legs. Other side. Up we come. Step it in. Let's go. Step back. Together, straight into the high jumps if you were taking that option on the first side. Down, lift up and jump, press, lift up and jump, down, lift up and jump. Otherwise, low impact, hands on hips, or add those arms. Press, lift, nice strong moves, okay? If you really want that cardio, go for that really big jump for me. You can do it. Yes, you can. Get that sweat happening. Get those endorphins really kicking in. You'll feel amazing for the rest of the day. Here we are, last 10 seconds. Stay with me, don't give up. There are only short intervals. Five and four and three and two and one. You're there, scissors. You could keep your hands behind your head if you would prefer. Otherwise, reach up, start here, down, good. And then reach those arms, press, 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 press. Beautiful, lift up higher, folding from the waist, not just bunching up at the neck. Keep it going, lift up, lift up. Challenge yourself, do a couple up here then go down a little bit. Do a couple where you come up a little, and then go down a little. Yes, up a little, down a little. We're almost there, 15 seconds. Keep moving. Keep breathing. Here it is, five, four, three, two, one. Bring the knees in. Tuck the toes under. Okay, two versions of burpees. 
Woohoo, you say. Love burpees. Oh, I know what you're really saying. All right, first one, low impact. Reach down, right leg steps out. You could come down to your knees if you wanted to for your push up. Right leg steps in, high impact, jump, down, press. Come down to your knees if you wish. Jump it in, jump it up, off you go. I'll stay low so I don't get too huffy and puffy on the microphone. And so it's always the right leg leading if you're doing the same version as me because we will switch to the left for our next round. And press. You could add just a jump at the top if you wanted to sort of try middle of the range. So it looks a little like this. Jump here and then stay low. It'll still get your heart rate up. Don't rush through your push up. I wanna see perfect technique of where your belly is zipped in, your back is not sagging, nor is your bottom sticking in the air. How are we going? Whew. Beautiful. Come on in. Lift up. Good, come down for me. Okay, so roll up time. Let's lay ourselves down. Take a deep breath in. You can have a little breather here. You can watch for the first one, then join in so we complete a whole minute. Arms are above the head. Breath in here. Arms, hands float above the shoulders. Exhale. This is where you're going to press imprint your lower spine down into the mat. Roll through. Dive forward. Beautiful. Scoop and round. Breath in. Exhale. Press down. Join with me for this next one. Here we go. We've got our minute. These are done. A little bit slower. It's almost feel like you get a bit of a chance to have a breather here. Exhale, press your spine down. Imagine that it's like a press stud. Each vertebra is a press stud going into the fastener. Don't skip any. Breath in, exhale, up and over, find that scoop, pull that navel away like someone's punching you in the belly button. Over we go. Breath in here, exhale, press down, pull the shoulders, plug them back in, or pull the arms back in. How are we going for time? 15 seconds, nice. It's nice to take a little bit of a breather, but we are going to have to get back to our burpees on the other side. Okay, so are you ready? That's our last one. Pull the knees into the chest, roll yourself up. Burpees, if you're doing the low impact version, this time you are stepping your left leg back. Let's go up, down, step, step, or you're jumping. Remember, I'll show you the high impact version. Here it is. Jump, down, jump, out, push up. Jump it in, jump it up, down, jump it out. Lower down with control, press up. Come on in, here's the low impact version again. With or without the optional jump, when you come up to standing, down we go. Remember, you can always take your push up with your knees on the ground. 15 seconds, guys. And then we're back to our roll ups. Up we go. Now, if you are doing the stepping out lower impact version, see if you can move a little quicker. And up and down. Out, out, push, up, there we go. Swing it around, really moving that body up and down and around. Okay, rolling up time again, just repeating. We might go a little faster this time. Breath in, exhale, scoop and roll, dive forward, round your back. Breath in, exhale. Even though we're going a touch faster, don't lose that articulation for me. Breath in. Exhale, scoop and roll. Feel like you're driving over a steel rod. Breath in. And let's make it a little more dramatic. It's a rod full of electricity, okay? So we really have to find that nice roundedness through our spine to reach over that imaginary electric rod. Scoop and roll. And here we go. That was our last one. Take the hands behind the knees, roll yourself up. Plie pulses with optional jumps. Here we go. Take it out to second position. 
nice and wide, 45 degrees. You're going one and two and squeeze. Here's your high impact version, one and two and jump. One and two and squeeze, or one and two and jump. Down, down, jump, down, down, jump, pulse, pulse, jump, pulse, pulse, jump, or down, down, squeeze. Down, down, squeeze. Up to you levels, down, down, squeeze. Excellent. How are we going? I'm gonna add the jumps now again. Press, press, push, press, press, push. We've got 15 seconds of whatever you're doing. That's it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one. Okay, roll down into your plank, step, step, step. Leg pull, find the plank, reach it long. You will lift the leg, pull the knee, press it out, lower down, lift the leg, pull the knee. Let's add a C curve to this. Lift the leg, pull the knee, press it out. So I want your nose to meet your knee, hopefully. Lift, exhale, press, lower, inhale, exhale, inhale, lower, inhale, exhale. Curl everything under. Time check, 15 seconds. Breathe through it. We've got our pulses with the plie jumps again. In five, four, three, two, one. There it is. Bend knees, roll yourself back up. Scoop and roll. Take the legs out. Here we go. Pulse, pulse, jump. Pulse, pulse, jump. Again, get all the way up there. Otherwise, pulse, pulse, squeeze. Pulse, pulse, squeeze. Good work. Halfway there with these already. See, 60 seconds is not long. And press, down we go. If you're doing low impact, down, down, squeeze and wrap. If you're doing high impact, get up there. Push, push, 15 seconds. Then we have our leg pull with C curve. Down we go, up, 10 seconds to go. How are we feeling guys? Hopefully you're working up a sweat. Feel free to grab that drink of water whenever you need. Down, down, we're there. Here we are, end of mat. Roll down, walk yourself out. Find that plank before you move. Shoulders back, belly in, lift, exhale, press, lower, lift, exhale, Press, lower, lift. <sighs> nice and strong. In, press, down, lift. Exhale, inhale, lower. Halfway there. Make sure you lengthen your body, your spine out. Each time you finish that move for me, really tuck that belly under. Find that Z curve. And 10 seconds. Good work. Five to go. And we're there. Bend the knees. Walk yourself up. Back to the cardio. Low impact, high impact. Legs are wide. Curtsy with a kick. 45 degrees. Curtsy, press. Kick, out, out we go second, curtsy, kick. Here we are, if you wanna take the high impact version, you can kick jump, step, press, kick jump, press back, good. I'll stay with the low. You can do the jump if you want when you do your kick and press. You can see I'm staying on the same leg. We'll switch next time. Out we go. Almost there, press down low, big kick up, down, push, down, kick. Five seconds. Last round, we're laying on our backs. Here we are, tabletop. 
hands by the side, tap and tap. You can go straight into a progression here. Lift up into your chest lift. Otherwise, stay with your head down. Keep the 90 degree angle behind the knees. Nice work. Let's go straight to something that's more challenging. Double leg down and up. Again, you could have your head down on the mat. We're wrapping it up, 20 seconds. Keep everything pulling in here like there's a heavy sandbag on your belly so you can't dome as you lower the legs. Keep it all tucked in. Breathe through it. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Hands behind knees, roll yourself up. Let's go for our curtsy kick on the other side. Legs out 45 degrees. Plie, curtsy, kick it, plie. Out we go. That's it. Kick, press. Add the arms if you wish. Okay, anything that you want to do here, kick it out. You can, whatever feels comfortable. Kick. You could go for a big kick to get your heart rate up instead of a jump, but just make sure your moves are controlled. We just don't want to be throwing that body around aimlessly. That's it. Press down, kick. Beautiful. Five, four, three, two, and one. Here we go. Roll yourself down. Tabletop to begin with. Hands are on the mat. Stretch the legs up low, higher rather. Now take them down low. Same thing applies here. Belly's tucked in like there's a heavy sandbag. Don't let this happen. Two things are going on here. I've arched my back, my belly's doming. Tuck it all in. Here's the progression. Shoulders down, but arms are reaching. Exhale as I lower down. Come on up. Nice and controlled. Good news, guys. We're up to our last round. Two sets, and then you're done for the day. So this is our second last set. One more set of two exercises, two times each. Down we go. And there we are, bend the knees, roll yourself up. Skater, skater steps, skater jumps. Here we are, start at the side of your mat. Step, tap, step, tap. You could keep this low, but make your steps big. Or jump, jump. You could reach your arm, one down to your toe, the other one up to the ceiling, for more cardio, your choice. You could be low, you could still add the arm. Move to the side of your mat. Get this moving for me. That's it. Remember, this is our last round, guys. If you feel like you haven't worked hard enough yet, now's your opportunity. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. Come on down. Hands are behind. Lift up. Open up. That's it. We're going to reach and tap the toe. Reach and tap the toe. Find your balance first. Don't rush it. You'll get the wobbles. You've got to work on changing your weight and drawing your abs in. Press and press. You could modify, oh look, you can tell, getting tired now. That could be your modification. Otherwise, dancing crab, lift up and reach and reach. That's it. Better the second time around, wrapping it up in five. You know the trick is for me not to look at you. The moment I look at you, I lose my balance. And two and one, slider steps. Or jumps. Let's go. 
Take it to the side and press. Jump it. This is the last round. Now, when I get to my dancing crab again, I'm not looking at you. Okay? I'll fall over. Keep going. Press. Press. Bigger. 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 You've got it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You can slow it down if you want because we've not done yet. That was the halfway mark. Are you ready? Let's go again. We're finishing off those last 20 seconds. Push, push, push. Get to each end of the mat, guys. You can do it. Here it is. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here we go. Not looking at you, not looking at you. All right, remember, you've got the other option to keep your bottom down. I'm going to look straight ahead. Lift up. Here we go. Reach, tap, reach, tap. Really try and get that hand to the outside of your ankle. Reach. Pull the navel in. Help switch the core on side to side. The problem is the clock is facing the camera. <laughs> so I'm going to have to look at one stage. I'll take a guess. All right. I think we're maybe 45 seconds into it. Oh, and I was right. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Guys, we are there. Lay yourself down. Take a big stretch. I hope you enjoyed that short and sweet combination of hit and core. If you feel you've got more in the tank, rewind, press play again, repeat it. Bring the knees into the chest, rock side to side, take a deep breath in, hands behind the knees, roll yourself up. Guys, amazing as always, your energy was spot on today. I hope you did enjoy today's hit class. Feel free to send me any suggestions of classes that you would like to see, but until that time, it's a bye for now.